Testimony in David Ware's trial was provided by two of the most significant people involved in the case. First, the state called the officer who survived the June 2020 shooting, Officer Arush Zarkashan. He testified this morning about the few things he actually remembers from that night. Later in the day, the state rested its case, and then the defense put up their only witness on the stand, the accused shooter himself, David Ware. He testified for several hours before the defense rested its case. Our Shea Smith was in the courtroom and has more on what everyone had to say. Officer Arresh Zarkashan testified this morning about what he remembers from that night. He says he only remembers meeting up with Sergeant Johnson before the traffic stop, but he doesn't remember the traffic stop itself. He says he doesn't remember interacting with Sergeant Johnson or being shot. In cross-examination, the defense asked Officer Zarkashan several times if he had watched any of the videos from that night. He said no. The defense asked Zarkashan several more questions like, don't you want to see the truth? And how are you going to find the truth if you don't watch the video. Officer Zarkashan's responses were, I don't want to watch the video and I don't want to watch me and my friend get shot. This afternoon, David Ware took the stand. The defense attorney's first question to Ware was, why did you shoot Sergeant Johnson and Officer Zarkashan? Ware's response was that he was in fear for his life and he felt like they were violating his rights. Right before the defense finished their questioning, his attorney asked him how he felt about shooting Officer Zarkashan and killing Sergeant Johnson. Ware got emotional and testified that he intended to shoot them in their body armor. He says he wanted to incapacitate them long enough for him to get away. The defense asked Ware about the last shot he fired, which was the shot that struck Sergeant Johnson in the head. The shot the Emmy testified was the most lethal. Ware told the jury that he fired that last shot because he thought Sergeant Johnson was reaching for his gun and he was scared that he would get shot in the back and die. In Ware's testimony, he also claims that Sergeant Johnson told Officer Zarkashan to turn off his body camera video. During the state's cross-examination, though, they pushed Ware on that, and Ware ultimately agreed that in the videos that were shown to the jury, that was not there. The prosecuting attorney also focused his questions around one word, choice. Attorney Gray asking Ware about choices he made that night, such as pulling out in front of Officer Zarkashan instead of letting him pass. The choice Ware made when he didn't follow officers' orders to get out of the vehicle and the choice he made with each gunshot he fired. As time went on, Ware was clearly agitated and irritated with the prosecution and questions. One of the state's last questions to Ware was about an incident in 2006 between him and Sergeant Johnson. Prosecutors asked him if he remembered the incident. Ware said he did, admitting to spitting on Sergeant Johnson. Prosecutors then asked Ware if he remembered threatening to kill Sergeant Johnson. Ware replied no. The state then asked if they put a former TPD officer who was at that incident on the stand and that officer testified that Ware did threaten Johnson, would that be a lie? Ware said, not necessarily. After a quick recross, the defense rested its case. The trial will pick back up tomorrow morning at 9.30.